about it. You're, uh... You're a little overpowering here. And I, uh... I don't want anything to happen here before uh, I really understand uh, what's well, happening. Ellen, you know, I'm Why are you running away from me? There's nothing to be afraid of. You're a beautiful... You're a beautiful, beautiful woman. Okay? Uh... I'm... just a little anxious... about the mall. <laughs> Well, speaking of changing subjects... Yes, I would like to see the uh, ground plans and the artist's sketches. I have them upstairs. You really want to see them? Yes, I would like to see them whenever. Well, I'll get them now. Good. Uh, could I go upstairs with you? Do you want to go upstairs? Yes. I just think the downstairs is absolutely beautiful, and I've just been dying to see what the upstairs looks like. Sure, follow the leader. Come okay. <laughs> Chandler belong behind bars, not in a court of law and justice. Good evening, Mrs. Wallingford. Oh, there are not words base enough to describe the, 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 the greedy, devious wretch that you are. Shall we uh, have mm -hmm. a seat? Mm -hmm. You would take a wrecking ball to the Taj Mahal if you thought I would put a penny in your pocket. This isn't the place, Mrs. Wallingford. Now, don't you lecture me, Mr. Hines. That man deserves the opprobrium of every single decent citizen in this community. You'd, you'd, be, you'd better calm down. You may have a stroke. Now oh, listen to me, you, you are nothing but a liar, you're a deceiver, be quiet, you're a, be quiet, be you quiet are a tiller of the hung. Madam, you flatter me. Oh, I'll see you hanged yet, you scoundrel. Please, Mrs. Wallington, I've heard you're not helping things. Well, I'm only speaking the truth. You mustn't make a scene in court. And why not? Because if Judge Myers hears you, he'll have you thrown out. Phoebe, please sit down. Oh, well, never mind. You'll be stopped, Adam Chandler, if I have to throw my body in front of your bulldozers. We won't bother with the formalities because of the late hour. Uh, take your seats, please. I have a petition here from Cortland Wallingford et al. for an injunction to stop Chandler Enterprises Incorporated from commencing the construction of a gambling mall. I have read the petition and am now ready to render my decision. Listen, if you're glad I'm back, you're on the right track, Jack. That's right. Don't close the door, don't pull the shade. Because uh, if you stick with Jesse, you got it made. <laughs> I tell you what, so brace yourself to be undone, because this next release is on the one. What? Oh, oh. hey. Welcome back. <laughs> yeah, yeah, don't ever leave us again. Yeah, baby. <laughs> oh, you an apology, okay? Hey, it's over and done with. Hey, it never should have started. Hey, come on. We all make mistakes. We just learn and you keep going. Huh? Well, tonight sure taught me, I'm telling you. But now we can get back to running the steam pit the way we started out to <laughs> yeah. do, okay? Okay. Uh -huh. Yeah, and we're uh -huh. going to be closer than we ever were. <laughs> okay. Speaking of close. Mrs. Nelson, how would you like to dance? Oh, I'd love to, Mr. Nelson. Come on. Let's go. <laughs> My friends, Mr. and Mrs. Hummer. Leave us alone. <laughs> <laughs> well, this is my lucky night. Why? Running into you. It's like finding a long lost friend. Oh, really? Well, I don't think we really know each other that well. Well, hey, you're a familiar face. I mean, I'm new in town. Well, don't, don't worry. What? I don't know that many people yet. Well, you're going to meet everyone, and then you'll just forget all about me. So... I doubt that. Uh, 
What are my chances of uh, seeing you again? Good to excellent. But are you sure you want to? Positive. Why? Well, I'm sure you haven't forgotten about Jenny's shower. <laughs> I had, till uh, you reminded me. Oh, really? I don't believe you. It's true. I mean, Jenny and uh, everything about her are a closed chapter in my life. You know, it's funny, it's, uh, it's as if it all happened to someone else. Well, that must be really great to be able to erase something like that. Oh, uh, what about you? Oh, well, I, I really don't have much to forget. Look, um, I meant what I said. Just call me any time. I'd love to go out with you. You got it. Uh, can I take you home? Oh, no, but um, you can walk me to my car. Lead the way. Well, how about you stay here, and um, I have to make a quick stop. I'll be right back. Okay. Okay. Wait a minute, wait a minute, don't you think it's a little dark in here? You'd use a little light. It's not dark at all. What are you talking about? Well, look at all, where do all these doors go? Where does that door go to? That, that's the entrance to the West Wing. Oh, could we take a look? No, it's locked. Well, do you have a key? Yeah, but I don't have it on me. Oh, well, why is it locked? Well, uh, th that's the place that Adam does uh, most of his painting. And most of it is just work in progress, and he doesn't want anybody to see it. Oh, come on, not even you. No, not even me. Oh, well, you see, I used to do a lot of painting myself. That's why I'm interested in it. And I would just love to see somebody else's studio and their work. It would mean so much to me. Couldn't you get the key? Couldn't no, we? I'm really sorry, Ellen. Ellen, we really, I can't. But we could just sneak in. I know you could sneak right out. I promise I wouldn't no, touch Ellen, anything. No, no, we can't sneak right. in. We can't sneak out. We can't do it. Look, that's an alarm system. That... Oh, he really takes his work seriously, doesn't he? Yes, he does. So come on now, okay? Forget about the West Wing. Come on. I've read the arguments presented by the plaintiffs very carefully. And the case presented by these plaintiffs, Cortland Wallingford, at all, has not persuaded me to issue the injunction which they seek. At least, not at this time. I shall therefore give said plaintiffs another 48 hours in which to prepare another brief. In that brief, I shall expect them to provide proof positive that the township of Pine Valley would suffer irreparable damage from said gambling mall proposed by Chandler Enterprises Incorporated. If the plaintiffs can provide such proof to my satisfaction, I shall then hand down the injunction to halt the construction of the mall. If they cannot, the construction may proceed. Now, Mr. Chandler, may I direct a word to you? Oh, uh, yes, Your Honor. I shall expect you to hold up the start of construction for 48 hours, or until I rule on the second brief. If you do commence construction before that time, I will issue an injunction to stop it. I understand, Your Honor. If that is all... No, uh, excuse me, please, Your Honor. Yes, Mr. Hines. I um, respectfully request that the plaintiffs be given more than uh, 48 hours to prepare this brief. 48 hours isn't time enough to uh, gather the necessary testimony and data to prove irreparable damage from the gambling mall. I uh, submit that uh, two weeks would be a fair amount of time. Uh, my decision stands. You have 48 hours. This hearing is adjourned.